Okay, in today's video we're going to show you how to measure resistance using the multimeter, resistance ohms. So, uh, first thing you want to do, is, if you haven't done it already, or if you don't know, is uh, watch the video on deciphering what the bands mean on a resistor, because otherwise this reading will make no sense. But if you already know what the bands mean and know what your value should be, then go ahead and watch this. But chances are you probably already know what you're doing if, you're, if you already know that. So, first thing we want to do after we figure out if we know what we're looking for, is to set our millimeter up to measure resistance, which it's the same as the continuity right there. Focus in. Then the next thing we want to do um, is go down here to the resistor we just made the video of. Now this will have a beep on uh, this particular model on anything below, I think it's 100 ohms or 100,000, I forget what the reading was. I think it's 100 ohms. This has a, uh, has a beep. I'll show you what uh, the difference in them are. So we're going to measure the the resistor that we just did the video on. All you do is to take your probes, that's what she said, and put them on either side. Hear the beep. And then we'll pan up here and I'll show you the reading. If you watch the other video, you determine this one should be 2.2 ohms. So if we got that reading and we've got a good resistor, but we can also have plus or minus 5% 5, 5 on this. So we can be off. As long as we get to something, I'm sure we'll be good. Let it settle down a bit. It'll keep on going down just for a few seconds. And we're at 2.7. Um, that's 2.6. That, that resistor is fine. Now on the other resistor, which is right below it right here, we're going to measure that one because I believe that one is over the uh, 100 ohms or whatever the, the case may be on this particular Okay, that, there you go. See, this one does not have the B, it's 100 ohms. Anything above that, it does not beep. So, you see, that resistor is at 158 ohms. So, no beep on that. And that's really all there is to reading the, the ohms resistance on a, uh, with a monometer. Um, not much more to it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments or you want to post a video response, please feel free to do so. Um, please subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching.